Different species of scary sharks inhabit the depths of the oceans all around the world. Mostly they're seen in the waters surrounding Australia. Who here hasn't heard about the mighty megalodon sharks? They're believed to be extinct, but if someone comes across a bloodthirsty beast, how do you ascertain if it is a megalodon or some other shark? Does the individual possess sufficient knowledge about sharks, including the largest and scariest great whites and the most legendary sharks that ever existed on the planet? So, how to make sure what you saw was a megalodon or just an ordinary hammerhead? Today, we'll talk about the 20 scary shark encounters that made people think that the megalodon might be making a comeback. But before we begin, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Hammerhead Shark a few years ago, a group of fishermen in Florida claimed they had an encounter with an extraordinary 13-foot-long hammerhead shark in the waters of Sanibel Island. They claimed their catch in the shallower waters. A team of three fishermen had been out in the Gulf of Mexico with stingray as bait, which is the favorite food of hammerheads. When they bagged the gigantic shark, they could not believe their eyes. The hammerhead had crossed out of the sea about 200 meters. Therefore, they wrestled with the giant for more than half an hour to get it back to the beach, they shared epic photos of themselves releasing the shark back to the sea. World's Biggest Great White Shark The gargantuan great white shark seen in the footage, also known as Deep Blue, can grow up to be 20 feet long, which is massive compared to an average great white that only achieves a length of 11 to 15 feet. Marine biologists are baffled by this magnificent creature, and her age is believed to be more than 50 years old. Great whites continue to grow in size with age, this amazing shark was found in 2013 off the coast of Mexico's Guadalupe Island in the Pacific Ocean. Scientists were able to tag Deep Blue so that they could track her movement. Alfred Dean's Great White In 1959, an individual named Alfred Dean, a resident of Australia, caught a mammoth great white shark with a regular old rod and reel. He overpowered the gigantic beast weighing 2,664 pounds. Some people believe that his record will never be beaten. At that time, he had seen a bigger great white shark and subsequently continued to try to catch a bigger fish, but couldn't succeed. But fortunately, he succeeded in catching the second largest. Gargantuan Bull Shark John Moore, a free diver off the coast of Florida, got through an intimate experience with one of the most dangerous types of sharks, known as the bull shark. He got very close to the shark when he was diving near Jupiter, Florida. Incredibly, he managed to come out alive, but the images of the shark show its massive size and frightening nature. The shark displayed her sharp teeth and was heavily pregnant. These sharks live in shallow waters not only along the coasts, but also in freshwater rivers and estuaries. Bull sharks prefer to go for a swim a long way. They are notoriously aggressive and are known to swim up to the Mississippi River as far as Alton, Illinois, which is about 700 miles from the ocean. They've been reported to track humans and the scariest thing about them is that they can be encountered anywhere from the River Ganges to Sydney Harbour and even in the Jersey Shore. Tiger Shark Tiger sharks are commonly found in waters around Australia. Keeping in view their abundance, fishermen are permitted to keep tiger shark in their daily catch. However, people felt anguish when photos of this massive tiger shark squeezed into a small fishing boat became available. Presently, tiger sharks are considered near-endangered on the IUCN's red list, Although their population has decreased drastically in the past 50 years, they're still not endangered enough to warrant the protection of Australian law. This 870-pound catch of the day was waiting for fishermen when they pulled back into the harbour in Sydney. It stirred up a lot of outrage when people found out about the men's apparent carelessness. This led to heated debates about the fate of the tiger shark. The New South Wales Game Fishing Association said they were not there just to murder everything in the water. Lemon Shark The lemon shark has been named so due to the yellowish appearance of its skin. It's found swimming among mangrove forests and coral reefs along the Atlantic and in different parts of the Pacific Ocean. It's considered a superior predator and also most sought after by fishermen who trade in the meat and fins of these animals. Its yellowish tone provides several benefits. In various areas where the lemon shark can be found, it permits the fish to blend in effectively with the golden sandy shallows. There it can be seen foraging for food. These sharks feed on crustaceans and bony fish as well as stingrays and the occasional sea bird. Lemon sharks have a specific band of vision which permits them to see the color and fine detail of everything found in their surroundings underwater. They usually prefer to live in shallow coastal waters, however they have occasionally been observed venturing into freshwater environments. 
they migrate through the open ocean. Great White Shark Some terrifying images showing how flimsy a little boat can feel when it's faced with a huge great white shark. David Tuckfield, along with his family, fishing in a small vessel off the coast of Western Australia, suddenly came across a very large great white shark which felt annoyed by their inordinate actions. The massive fish circled the vessel several times and then it started to attack the boat. It was a great white shark that had stalked the coastline in the famous 1975 movie Jaws. It's a terrible sea monster, a purpose-built killing machine having various features designed to make it one of the most proficient hunters on the earth. They have three rows of sharp teeth, a total of 300. It's thought that half of all shark attacks throughout the world may be attributed to great whites. Some scientists opine that the shark does not like human flesh, but it attacks merely out of curiosity. Sand Tiger Shark The sand tiger shark is pretty docile and does not pose a real threat to humans. There are only a few recorded incidents where a sand tiger shark has attacked humans. Although they possess an immensely scary set of teeth and sinister eyes, they're not related to a very terrifying tiger shark as their temperament is quite different. The jagged teeth of the sand tiger shark makes it seem like a dangerous beast, however its jaws are not large enough to cause a human fatality. They can only bite once they've mistaken a human for a fish or crustacean. Blue Shark Blue sharks possess big round eyes and their expression gives them a really strange appearance. They grow up to 9 or 10 feet in length but usually prefer to feed on smaller prey like fish and squids, mostly in deeper waters where they are found in abundance. They are migratory animals and travel across complete oceans several times during their lifetime. The migration is aimed at finding feeding pastures as well as mates. When they find mating partners, things become a little bit aggressive. The male blue shark often bites the female shark during their special cuddle, as the female blue shark has developed an extra thick skin to safeguard against being injured during the rough course. They are found in all parts of the world. There have only been a few recorded incidents of blue sharks biting humans. Oceanic White Tip Shark This species of shark is found in all the oceans in the warmer latitudes. They live on open seas and are effective top predators. They're fond of eating bony fish and squid. Oceanic white tip sharks enjoy eating together, presenting a much scarier sight. They're among few of the fish species who are known to have bitten and killed a human. However, these incidents are quite rare and are often the result of mistaken identity. Black tip sharks. Black tip sharks are very common. They're usually medium sized and are named for their black tipped fins. They're found in coastal waters close to beaches in coral reefs and estuaries as well as bays. They are migratory species and tend to hang around in groups and travel together in groups of females or males. Despite their sizable population, they are facing the risk of overfishing and accidental capture. They're fished commercially and their meat is popular in the markets of America, Mexico and the Mediterranean. Their fins are also sold in East Asia, the USA and Mexico. In addition, they're also popular among the recreational fishing community. Prince Edward Island Shark in 1983, a gigantic great white shark was hauled up dead in a net off Prince Edward Island in Canada. Its mammoth size drew extensive attention. In the recent past, it has been included in the Discovery Channel's most legendary sharks, and it was concluded that besides its huge size, it was also a teenager. Therefore, it would have continued to grow further to an enormous size. With advancements in technology, scientists can test the radioactivity level in an animal to determine its age. During the 1950s and 60s, the nuclear testing method was used. This technology has made scientists believe that sharks grow slowly. Some sharks may take around 30 years to reach maturity. Mexico's Great White Shark In 2012, two fishermen in Mexico brought home a mammoth fish purely by accident. While conducting routine fishing in the Sea of Cortez while hauling their net, these fishermen found a massive great white shark in their net. The unfortunate beast was already dead and it was about 20 feet long with an estimated weight of 2,000 pounds. Due to the small size of their boat, they had to tow the beast back to land. Thresher Shark The Thresher Shark has a unique feature related to its tail that makes it a fierce hunter. Unlike the tails of other regular sharks, Thresher Sharks have a specially long whip-like tail which is used to kill its prey. It is a ruthless technique involving swimming at high speeds towards its prospective prey pulling up extremely fast and then whipping its tail from behind over its head and down onto the victim. They're capable of whipping their tails up to 80 miles per hour. Application of enormous force by thresher shark explodes every organ of their prey. 
swim bladders will rupture, the spine will shatter, and bits and pieces will float all over. Six Gill Shark In 2002, an angler named Clemens Rump caught a massive six gill shark off the coast of Ascension Island in the South Atlantic Ocean. This huge creature weighed about 1,298 pounds. It surprised everyone as it is rarely seen in the sea. Six gill shark is also sometimes called the cow shark. It can grow up to 20 feet long and usually inhabits tropical waters. Its diet varies depending on the location. This shark is not closely related to any other species of living sharks. They're more closely related to fossils. They're found in deep waters and are hardly seen in waters shallower than 39 feet, and even those are only juveniles. The adults are found at depths of 330 feet and below. El Monstruo An El Monstruo shark was caught in 1945 off the coast of Havana, Cuba. It's also one of the sharks the Discovery Channel deemed worthy of an investigation for its most legendary shark show. It means that the legend of El Monstruo has been confirmed as genuine. Six fishermen had set on a small boat equipped with only ropes and harpoons to find a big fish. They came across the monster, hooked it, continued to wrestle with the beast for the whole night and the next day. Finally, they hauled it back to port and people rushed to see it. The massive shark measured 21 feet in length and weighed 7,000 pounds. It was named El Monstruo de Camar. Phillips Island's Great White Shark In the 1970s, a huge great white shark was caught off the coast of Phillips Island, located just off the southern coast of Australia. A person named Vic Hislop managed to capture 20 feet long and weighing a whopping two tons. It was approximately 65 years old. Allegedly, this catch took five days of effort by the fishermen. Environmentalists questioned the killing of the shark, especially considering its age and size. Mundus Great White Shark in the summer of 1986, an enormous killer shark stalked the waters near the Clam and Chowder House at Salafar's Dock in Montauk, New York. The actual head of the monster shark has been mounted on the wall for people to see. The shark head weighed a massive 3,427 pounds and was caught by a fisherman with a rod and reel. It happened about 30 miles southeast of Montauk. Massive Shark, New England Coast a group of people along the coast of Massachusetts came across a gigantic shark which swam close to the vessel for a few moments. The impressive animal was captured on drone footage. The immense size of the shark raised the question of whether it was a megalodon or not. Megalodon is believed to be extinct. They were believed to be the largest sharks that ever existed on our planet. It's estimated that the adult megalodon might have been as long as 30 feet. Some experts think that the megalodon was 80 feet long. Waters off the coast of Massachusetts do not have such a mammoth creature. The animal observed was a basking shark, which is considered to be the second largest species of present-day sharks. It can attain a length of 206 feet. This isn't the first time people believe that the megalodons really exist. A couple of images went viral on the internet that shows an insanely massive shark about to swallow a huge ship whole. This is apparently a South African naval ship going about its business. The shark probably crept up behind the ship in silence. Well, we sure would like to believe this story. Some people on the internet were pretty insistent that this was a megalodon sighting, but most think it's a photoshopped image. The internet is full of shocking images, but we're not sure which one is real or which is fake. What do you think? Do you think any one of these sharks could have been a megalodon? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more amazing videos.